Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. This is the floor that I was thinking of. That's an incredibly difficult floor. So, uh, we've got in the center here cannon beetles. Yeah, um, hide your Pikmin. Oh! <laughs> Just dropped off from the ceiling. Alright, that's nice. Uh, I'll save that in case I lose Pikmin, and I probably will lose Pikmin. Oh, yes! Purple! I love you, Purple. You are a beautiful sight. I can get more Violet Pikmin. Well, Purple Pikmin from the Violet Candy Pop button. Yeah, anyway, <laughs> let's get these guys plucked and they'll come in handy for I mean versus the cannon beetles too well they come in handy versus a lot of enemies uh oh oh mayday <laughs> yeah it's it's like a shooting gallery <laughs> what you want to do is probably take out this guy first and uh, just sort of stun it with purples that's what they're there for uh, oh shoot the purples didn't stun it that's why I don't like using purples in all circumstances. <laughs> okay, still relatively safe. <laughs> okay, we're good. Kind of, maybe. Let's see if we can stun it this time. Oh, 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 oh shoot! Oh shoot! Come over here! Come over here! Okay. Oh yeah! All right, one threat done. Many more on this floor to go, because I know this floor, and it is a horrible, horrible floor of doom. <laughs> Alright, so, remember that Queen Candy Pop Bud, for it will be nice to regain the Pikmin I lost. Remember the Candy Pop Bud. Squish! And squish! Oh god, oh god, oh god! I've attracted it because I threw a Pikmin too far. Okay, so there's another one there. It's good to know. Um, no, come on, over here. Just stop getting stuck on the toy blocks. There we go. <laughs> uh, how should I approach that one? Well, first I should clear out the little dwarf bull bears. That's for sure. They are a pain. And by the way, um, they could have those. Uh, Cannon beetles could appear in any one of these sorts of spots. Not this one, though. It's probably The other one is probably in uh, that one up there. Because uh, I'm pretty sure there's three on this floor. We're going to see uh, fairly shortly here. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. No nibbles. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah! Oh, oh, you got really lucky to dodge those purples. <laughs> I think I'm going to leave some of these guys as like a shield. I wonder if I'm going to have to defeat them all, though. I might not have to if, oh god, Metites! Metites! Kill her off with purples! Yes! Get the prizes! Okay... Stop, stop being scared, you're okay. Everything's alright. Okay. Um... Hmm... Hmm... Okay, let's pull the Pikmin through it. And see what we can flower up. Yeah. Oh, mm, 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 stop it, stop it. No, 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 just not. Okay, you'll be fine. <laughs> just as long as you don't, uh, don't, uh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, you're good. <laughs> uh, actually, hold on, I'm gonna, I got a strategy here. Maybe I won't have to deal with it after all. Let's, uh, no, 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 I'm gonna use whites for the other one. Uh, uh actually, I don't know. Uh, hmm. How fast will you guys be able to get that past that cannon beetle? Probably not very fast, but you might prove to be a good distraction while I get that other thing. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Is that gonna be okay? Yes, okay. <laughs> We're good, kind of, because we still got that to get. Get distracted with a captain or something. Oh yeah. Oh, almost, White's almost got squished there. Swarm it! Swarm that sucker! Good! Purple almost got squished. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! Okay. <laughs> oh no, not cutscene! Not right now! That could squish everything! Because enemies can still attack, apparently, in cutscenes. Boom cone! Yeah, it's one of those party popper things where you pull on the string. Okay, uh, oh god. Okay, we're good. We're still good, seemingly. 
Okay, fire there, good. I'm gonna get purples. Fire there, good. And finish it off, finish it off, finish it off! Oh yeah! Now I can get this antenna. Safely. <laughs> oh, that scared me a little though. Uh, this, is, this is taking forever. <laughs> okay, there's a couple leaves on here. Uh, I got all flowers on the antenna, though. I guess I'll take back the cannon beetle. And this cannon... Oh my god, I forgot about you. Um... Uh-oh. Um... Okay. They didn't... They didn't die? Oh, purple spray, hello! I guess I... I guess there's more on this floor than I thought. Or wait, did I only kill two of them? Hmm. Well, in any case, what I've got to do here is now maximize my purple, you know, sprays. <laughs> so, up. Oh. Cutscene for the antenna! What's it called? What's it called? What's it called? Well, it's not very zoomed in on it, is there? I mean, is it? Sulking antenna! <laughs> and, oh, that's the last thing of the floor. Good. Alright, let's sneak by so I don't get cannon beetled. Hey, uh oh, I hear it. I hear it. It's not not gonna be good. Okay, we're good. <laughs> All right, now as I said, don't forget about. Oh wait, wait, hold on. I'm gonna leave one captain here. I'm gonna do not forget about the Queen Candy Pop Bud. I remembered it. I remembered it. So okay, I'm gonna trade in. Uh, I guess a blue for the rest of. I mean, a bunch of yellows, I suppose. So, oh, yeah, um, let's time this right here. We got red, and we got yellow, there we go. And, woo! Back up to 100, just like that. Unfortunately, I can't replace the whites, but, yeah. <laughs> and pluck them out. I don't think there's anything else that's worthy of really doing here. Uh, I mean, I guess I could take stuff back, but, as I said, worthy of doing here. But I don't, unless you're like going for a high score or something like that, but you can actually max out at 99, you know, 99999 if you just keep going inside caves, so it's not really that great of a difficulty to uh, maximize your score. Uh, oh, there's my leaves. I was looking to say. Uh, okay, suck, 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 suck. Da, da, da. Oh, you guys had to go on the metites. You know what? That's actually a good idea. I'm gonna. Clear out the metites here, just so that my others can uh, flower up. How's that sound? Good? I thought so. Guess I'm gonna chuck a bunch of Pikmin here. I want just the leaves here, preferably. Oh, I thought I was holding a Pikmin. Great. <laughs> well, that's a nice, uh, nice use of a spray there, PK Gam. <laughs> Well, purple sprays are way more better than, uh, I mean, way better than red sprays anyway. I mean, granted, red, red sprays are great, but uh, purple sprays are just far, far more useful in my opinion. Alright, let's get out of here before I waste more stuff. <laughs> Final floor! And it has one of the more strategic floors in the game. Um, it's one of those sorts of, th sorts of things where you want to clear stuff out uh, with what certain color and then sort of kind of work work your way in with other stuff And it also has one of my favorite enemies of the game the giant bread bog, which is the boss You actually don't get regular boss music for this thing, too. That's the giant bread bog right there. Look at that thing <laughs> It's ridiculous Anyway, it's gonna go. Yeah, it usually goes for uh that ham or something on the floor because it's it's a glutton after all it's the glutton's kitchen and uh, you can try and take stuff back with Pikmin but chances are they're gonna get zapped if you don't have all yellows so here's my strategy what I'm gonna do here is separate the colors and just oh no um is that worthy of a restart probably not so I'm just gonna leave them like that just had to attack that didn't you just had to attack that Oh, you actually, oh, you actually managed to take care of it completely. Very nice. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Didn't have to deal with that, actually. All right, so, um, the giant bread bog, more info on it. If it takes something back to its nest and it has taken damage, it will heal up everything. Everything. Seriously. 
Okay, now it's gonna go for this right here, so I'm going to put a purple on it, and some yellows, there we go. It's not gonna be able to handle that purple, yeah! <laughs> Look at that thing, it's ridiculous. <laughs> it's gonna close up here. Oh, it's, it's fighting it! It's fighting it! Who will win? Will it be the Pikmin or will it be the giant bread Oh, I think you know! <laughs> Alright, I need to get something else to, uh... Uh, for it to take back to the pod, uh, or I should say, it, for it to take back to its home, but it's not going to, oh shoot, oh shoot, okay. <laughs> okay there we go. Okay, giant bread bug, you were on, oh, there you are, you got stuck on something. Hey, uh, how about this delightful treat over here? Would you like to eat this anode beetle? Of course you would like to eat this anode beetle, who wouldn't? I mean, come on now, it's an anode beetle. But, you're gonna have to battle the Pikmin to get it! Oh, yes! <laughs> it's just a loaf of bread with a head it's, and feet. It's so awesome. And this should take care of it. it. Takes only two hits. Well, two returns back to the onion to finish it off. And it has an eraser. What's this eraser for, you may ask? Well, you'll see. Wah! <laughs> Processing. How bizarre. An item here appears to have fallen out of that freakish creature. And it must have been a greedy beast of saw or something like this. <laughs> yeah, it actually ate something that's pretty well indigestible. So let's take uh, everything back here and we're gonna see what it is right here, right now. Because we can use it on this floor right here, right now, believe it or not. Woo! Oh yeah! Dream material, and I have no idea what brand this is, if it's actually a brand. Anyway, barcode, let's go on. <laughs> this intriguing material does not conduct electricity. It is far more advanced than the material I was researching. How frustrating. <laughs> a spacesuit made from this wonder alloy would insulate the wearer from electric shocks. Excellent, this new material has allowed me to complete my anti-electrifier. It is my own invention, with only the smallest iota of outside inspiration. <laughs> I have re reconfigured your suits with this new material. They will now protect you from electricity, and that's what you can use on this floor, because you will no longer take damage from electric obstacles. Isn't that awesome? And you're gonna get that baloney back if I don't help you. Or is that ham? I think it's ham, actually. Hey, get that! No, stop, stop, no! No, 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 You don't you dare take all those whites in with you. I don't care if you take that, because I can get that back from you later. Uh, once I kill you, your nest will spew out whatever you took in there. Because I already I already noticed that I have to uh, um, take care of something that took a donut in. It's one of those two. So yeah, let's uh, let's make some food for it right here. And this is what I mean about it being a very strategic floor because you you want to clear stuff out, but at the same time you need that stuff. So you can't just like randomly take it back to the pod just because. All right, it's oh this one's going for it. Okay, uh, just as long as you don't take it around that way, I'll be okay with that. Uh, okay, you're gonna go that way. Very good. Okay, now it's gonna be perfectly safe, and then I'll do some scratch damage on it a little bit later. Uh, okay, I'm gonna first I'm gonna take care of this anode beetle here. Get some more food for the other one. And there we go. And it just rolled! <laughs> and scratch damage! Scratch damage! Just one more scratchy! Scratchy, 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 good. Okay, we leave them to be. And now I gotta get over here to be ready for this one right here. And there we go. Oh, got my scratch damage. Oh no no, not 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 yet, not yet. I gotta get him on it. There we go. And we're good! This floor should be complete. Well, you know, there's stuff to grab, but Oh, oh, it didn't... Oh, wait. Oh, what? Who grabbed the donut, then? I guess it was you, then. So, uh, yeah, that other one ate, or brought in the ham and the egg, and this one must have brought in the donut. Okay. Uh, by the way, listen to their sounds. <laughs> I should say the sound of the music. This uh, music is custom, I should say, is special just for this uh, boss battle here. And that's what happens when you kill off one of the... Uh, uh, bread bugs. Its nest completely empties out and you're able to get its spoils. And now the treasure is all mine! All handy right in the center here! Because they all took it back to their nests. Isn't that awesome? Oh yeah! Okay, this is done. 
And let's just uh, wipe this out just to be safe. I should probably wipe out the other anode beetles as well. You know, once they're finished with that. And there we go. It's uh, oh, back at the egg. What's the egg called? Mmm, delicioso. Hideous Victor. <laughs> I guess it doesn't look delicious to the ship. Okay, oh, back with the ham. I believe this is called the Meat of Champions. Right, right, right. Yes. <laughs> this is a very memorable name. And one more thing. Very, very soon here. And flip, flip, flip. Oh, that's yeah, fine. They'll be stunned uh, after the cutscene anyway. Donuts. What's the donut called? Sweet Dreamer. <laughs> and this floor is complete, so I don't have to do any more. Woohoo! Okay, everything looks safe. Everything is good to go. Because there's no more ways for them to make arcs. And this is the final floor. So, there we go. 100% complete. Another cave. You know, I could probably just leave my Pikmin here. <laughs> you know, without having to clear the way or anything like that. I guess I'm just uh, messing around here. But yeah, looks like we're done here. So, let's exit. Woo! And of course, we gotta finish off uh, the rest of the perplexing pools day, of course. You know, I said of course twice there, but whatever! This went well, so... <laughs> I can afford that slight mistake in commentary. <laughs> Eleven. <laughs> it's not that dangerous <laughs> dangerous of an area either, it's just stakes happen. Alright! 100%! Woo. Now, what else will I be able to do this day? Probably not that much. <laughs> but I guess we're gonna see. Um, as a matter of fact, all the rest of the stuff that we gotta do is blue-centric. So I should probably put all the Pikmin that aren't blue back into their respective places before I move on here. And there we go. And why did I do that? I do not know. <laughs> okay. And let's race over there with a lot of blues. By the way, uh, as a, uh, something to make note of, you probably should not... Um, have more than um, 50 or so blues going into the next uh, special underground area because oh boy it's a doozy <laughs> and people have been looking forward to me doing this place because it's one of the most notorious places in the game but I have a strategy for it of course so we're gonna see how well that strategy works out but we're also gonna see how much I can clear out over here on the side I should say set up over on this side before I uh, uh, before the day ends off. So yeah, got 50 blues with me here. By the way, when a place is complete, you can see a flag over that. If you didn't notice that before, I never mentioned that. So uh, oh, might as well clear you out. There we go. And you'll probably be able to get that back to the base in time, aren't you? Because that's gonna you're, yeah. You're, mm, I don't know. You're a leaf. Eh, I'll chance that you're probably decent enough. Uh, you guys are pretty big. <laughs> I'm just gonna sneak by you if you don't mind. Uh, yeah, there we go. I'll deal with you later when I have more time to deal with you, but for now, I'm gonna go for the dumples. Yeah! There we go. Done. And, uh, withering blowhog. You've most certainly gotta go, otherwise, you're gonna deflower my Pikmin. And there's the place. The place that you can only enter with blue Pikmin. That is one of the hardest dungeons in the entire game. And, uh, how is that Pikmin doing? Is it, uh, even close to the bay? Mm, ooh, I don't think it's gonna make it back. <laughs> that was probably a bad choice on my part, but it was an experiment more than anything. Alright, so uh, I'm probably just gonna stay here and wait out the time, and hope that other one gets back. <laughs> maybe it will, maybe it won't, I guess we shall see. Hopefully, it probably won't, but, well... It's done now. <laughs> Woo! Day end! And yep, there's only gonna be one more day left here. Not much to do. Um, although the stuff that's left to do is going to be really tedious. Uh, that, that, uh, those blocks that you've seen that I was running around there next to the notorious dungeon were a, um, 
uh, really annoying weight puzzle. And yeah, that blue didn't make it back, as you can tell there. I didn't think so. I'm sorry, blue. That was a poor strategic choice on my part. <laughs> I wanted to get a Pikmin out of it, but I ended up losing a Pikmin as a result. But yeah. Well, <laughs> all right, there we go. That's all the stuff we got. Woo! And Pikmin propagation. Yeah, lights are down again. <laughs> Figures. There'll be more places to get whites anyway. Louie, we suddenly stopped hearing from you. Everything okay? If things get tough, you can always come home. I'll stock up on those pick pick carrots you love. Aww, oh, that's so sweet. And with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part. Okay, there's clearly been something weird going on here. I've been doing some experiments, and, well, watch this. I'm going to take my eyes off the game, and then I'm going to move back over. It's something different. Okay, let's try this again. One more time. going to move off to the side, and then we're going to come back over and... Salesman Snorlax, what are you doing here? I don't know. I was in the bath. Oh, oh I better... They're not lucky, he's nude. Okay, well, maybe... Maybe it'll still be Snorlax, maybe it won't be. Who knows? No, it's a deck of Aviator playing cards. Okay, let's try it again. Maybe... Maybe it'll be something different. Maybe it'll be the same thing, though I doubt it. It's a Ping I-2 Golf Wedge. Pitching wedge to be exact. What? This is getting weird. How? Why? Do any of these things have any sense to them? Like, why? Why would they keep switching places with each other? Ah, let's try it again. Let's see if there's gonna be something different if we go back over here and then we come back over. Ah! Pool ball. Okay, this is getting really weird now. All right, all right, one more time. Just one more time, I swear. And pan back over carefully. Uh-oh. 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 